93.3 KGSR. Radio Austin. Houndmouth on 93.3 KGSR. You guys are one of my favorite party bands in that I only seem to see you at parties. Dur- during South by Southwest, you played with Gary Clark Jr. over yeah, at gsd and right. Last night, you, you played a party at Arlen Studios uh, along with, well, Gary Clark Jr. played and Shaky Graves yeah. and then basically the Foo Fighters. Mm-hmm, basically. Yeah, and with, with some strokes thrown in. Right, right. Except you didn't see that because you left. <laughs> we did. It's unlike us to leave a party. But I think we're going to get wise eventually and try and start taking a cut from the bar venues, you know? I feel like that, that's what Buffett does. And, I, you know, I'm trying to learn our, our, uh, our fan base. And I, I, from what I know, they're drinkers. But that doesn't speak to you being such a responsible adult last night to leave early. That was a moment of clarity. <laughs> because you knew what lied ahead. Exactly. Don't get me wrong, we probably had about six or seven vodkas last night. <laughs> well, I imagine the, the schedule that you keep is, is tough on the four-part harmonies. Um, where, did, where did you figure out that those four-part harmonies... Because I mean, there are bands with, obviously, four people who don't necessarily sing well together. Yeah, um, well, we didn't try and, like, change our voices, you know? Like, it, I feel like there's when people sing harmonies you can kind of like blend your voice in together and we just never kind of took to doing that but as far as like I think we got lucky on registers because I have a kind of a high voice for a dude and Katie's got a high voice because you know she's a woman and uh, Zach and Shane are always kind of battling for that low but Zach's got a really high falsetto he can go to so it's you know we try and figure out where we fit in over the years before you, you started on the highfalutin party circuit in Austin. Yeah. This was a town that was good to you. This was a town that early on said, we like Houndmouth. Right. Like one of our first shows was South by Southwest, and that's where we got signed and everything started kind of in Austin. Yeah, it's 2012. Or 13. And, and you played an ACL before, right? 2012 or 13. Right. You played the park, I mean, and... I bet that was 2013. I have no idea. <laughs> I've been asking all the uh, brother-sister bands who keeps who in check, but without being siblings, I can see who keeps who in check here. (laughs) Hey! Yes! What do you remember about the ACL appearance, the first one where I imagine you played the tiniest stage? I mean, I didn't see it, but I'm... What what do we remember about it? I remember it being really hot. That's all I remember. Uh, Just being really hot. Which is a good thing. It's way better than playing in the cold. You know? Fingers get all cramped up, hurt. Well, you would have liked this festival a couple of years before that even when yeah. it was always in August slash September and it was 106 degrees every day. Oh, no. That's crazy. Yeah. This is amazing. Look it's at this. It's a great time to have a festival. Right? Yeah. I don't know. I'm asking for applause for the weather, but whatever. <laughs> that's what it's come Give to. Give for the weather. Because I did stay at the party. <laughs> that, that's what it's come to. Here they are again, live on KGSR, Houndmouth. <laughs>
Thank you. Thank you. That's Houndmouth Live on 93.3 KGSR. That wraps it up for us today.